Mario, Donkey Kong, woo! Check them out. like 6 15 in the morning right now it may not seem early to a lot of people but i did have to close last night so i'm a little bit tired just from that but this is going to be really cool we got a lot of the guys they all got days off so we're just trying to take advantage of those summer flea market halls and uh we're gonna go in to the flea market early which is something we haven't done in a long time i'm really happy about that and not only that we got a cool little group together this is just gonna be some fun filming and uh hunting in general for the whole guys and uh right now i'm just about to message them in the group chat hopefully that they're showered hopefully they're ready to go because i'm about to go pick them up so without further ado i gotta get showered and stuff myself so i'll see you guys in a bit So I'm going to pick up the rest of the guys right now. Um, Hold up. Yeah, I see Leo's awake right now. He's down the street from me, which is cool because uh, sometimes Leo can hibernate like a bear. And it's good that he's awake right now. And then I'm going to go get Sam and Fruit, and we should be ready to roll. I'm just getting uh, the guys in the car right now, and then we'll be on our way. There's that Leo boy. You know, I was trying to get you to pick me up so that I could record a joke of saying like Isaac went all his way to pick me up and just show that you live like two houses away from me. You really trying to show our street right now on the internet? I mean, f*** it. No, <laughs> I'm not trying to show mine. You can get in the car though. All right, so next is Sam and Fruit and we'll be good to go from there. Um, Sam hasn't hit us up on the group chat, so... He told me he's up. Oh, okay, good. Well, he, he posted this message that said, if the teacher isn't here in 15 minutes, you're technically allowed to leave. So I can't tell if that was a reference towards us not picking him up within 15 minutes, so he's saying he's about to dip on us, but... Uh, the, the thing I'm not sure of is, what the f*** does that meme even mean? Or how'd that become a meme? I, I don't get it. I don't know. Different time, different topic. Yeah, I, I guess. But, so... How much money did you bring with you, Leo? 30. Oh, sh So I have two very lonely $5 bills. Hopefully I find a couple sellers who are willing to part with very nice things for two very lonely $5 bills. Unrealistic, but the thing is, it's the flea market, so it's you possible. never know. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. <laughs> there he is. <laughs> Look at all oh, no. oh, What the heck is this? Power Rangers. I forgot I had Lights. that in there. Rescue. Alright. What's up? Me and Noah are saying that like people are probably already like super there for like two hours or something by now. Especially because it's actually decent weather right now. Yeah, I was looking at, you know, Give or take, we're in California, so, and it's the summer, so we could have been expecting something like 80 degrees at 6 a.m., but no, I was looking at the weather, and we got some cool 70 degree weather, so that's just working towards our favor. We can stay out there longer and not have to worry about saying, let's get the hell out of here, Leo. Yeah. Leo's passed out. Oh, yeah. Uh, for those of you that don't know, I do terribly with the heat. I could actually have, like, oh, that's just stop cussing that. I could actually have anxiety attacks. I've had anxiety attacks from the heat before. Yeah, last time it was really hot. Yeah. But I think that's probably why we still found some good stuff. That yeah, sure. that would make sense. Because it was unbearably hot. So, like, I think the fact that it was super hot made it so people wanted to leave early. And we ended up finding, like, PSP games for, like, 2 or $3. And this one guy even had them for $1. Being a PSP guy, that's what that was really cool for me. Yeah. Alright, so what are we gonna try to cop today? I brought ten dollars on me, so <laughs> trying to get a ten dollar chrono trigger. <laughs> ten dollars. You laugh, but I'm serious. No, I know. <laughs> I know you are. <laughs> are you Leo? I got thirty bucks, I'm just going wherever the wild wind blows. My Chito. Same got thirty bucks looking for that sealed, untouched Majora's mask. 
You hella just came up with that right now, huh? Yeah, I did. I have <laughs> words on my face. Sealed. Untouched. <laughs> I have I have four dollars. Hey. So worst case if I don't find anything. Tell me why Sam's gonna find the best thing for that money. I'm buying a churro. There you go. Churro. Oh, yeah, you already thing. won. Yeah. We're trying to Probably get a mixer. Probably better than me already. I'm trying to find a mixer of ten dollars. But I guess we'll see whatever we find, right? So this is what happened. Leo Leo's talking a little smug about it right now, but he's not admitting that this this was kind of. A move yesterday he tells me hey uh, I decided because I told him hey I really am legit hardcore looking for fun sugar if you guys see it let me know and he's like all right and, and yesterday he comes at me he's like hey I got a dibs that I want um, since uh, you're looking for front trigger I was like all right sure you know that's fair and he goes yeah every PS1 Square Enix game I want dibs and I was like all right cool Leo I like Square Enix games too on the PlayStation 1 you Here's know what some, I mean? he, all right, all right, Admittedly, all right. it is a big let's, move let's hear it it's a big move i'll admit it but i've already got basically all the ff games i need i don't give, give a shit about like bushido blade or anything like that i'm talking parasite Eve one and two einhander or uh vagrant story mostly oh it's the jersey too hey look Leo. video game stuff i'll come back right all right uh, but just a cable. It looks like a PC version anyways. Battlefield PS4, PS3, Xbox One, 360, PC, and Mac. Honestly, I might as well ask. What's up, boss? How's it going? Don't be afraid to ask. I sell this on uh, eBay all the time because they're universal. Because that plug and USB, you can use it for anyone, you know what I mean? I'll do a uh, 15 on it. They're 40 bucks on eBay. Hmm. Not sure I have to gonna come I'm gonna have to come around for that. All right. so counter it off and give me something. At least I can take is 10. That's all right. so I'm gonna throw out 15. If you got 10, you better take it. <laughs> That's good. Because it's universal. Yeah, I think it's too early, so we're gonna take another lap. Yeah, yeah, yeah. go ahead, bro. Worst case, worst case, you do get 50 for it. Yeah, no, exactly. <laughs> yeah, we'll be around. All right. I thought about getting rock before. I'm like, hey, screw it, playing guitar on my PS4, that'd be tight. The guy spotted a little table over there with some games, so. See what Sam does. You found my Chrono Trigger? Nah, it's just a bunch of sports games and Jaws. Uh, Jaws and Leash. Those are the rare games. We stumbled across a vendor who actually had a lot of games, but they were ridiculously high priced. I mean, just look at these labels, $30 for Banjo, Star Fox 25, Super Mario World $45, and then these box Sega games that are up here, there's uh, Champions for $45, that game isn't even worth that much, we didn't even bother asking the prices of the rest, because it was so expensive and we just left. We just ran into one of our favorite resellers, that's what he is, we can't really give away his name right now, but we ran into one of our favorite ones, he usually gives us a really good deal. He shows us this bag and he's got hard gold and soul silver. One of them's still in like SNES. the cardboard box. He had uh, Mario 64, some Pokemon strategy guides. So hopefully we'll get some of that look. You gonna buy that, Sam? Nah. But Incredibles 2. That's true. Hey, buy that cow skull. looking at right now Leo PlayStation move controllers uh, I don't have any PlayStation move games but it's good to buy them just in case I ever do because uh, those things are starting to get decently priced now 
like what 35 views at GameStop. Were there actually good games on the PlayStation Move? Uh, I mean, I had a Wii, so I didn't really bother with it when it came out because I don't know. I was a little. Fan I know that a lot of games out. they had yeah, were Xbox. AO. A lot of the games oh. they had were kind of like a post converted to a PlayStation Move. So, for example, something like Killzone 3 was made PlayStation Move compatible or something like that. Okay. Yeah, Leo wants me to shut up right now because we just found a, a guy with games. Right here. Cop. Oh yeah, true. Square Enix gives a little. This looks oh, kind of cool. Square Enix games, I want square. What's the difference? But well, that is square. It's shaped with square. True? Yeah. The guy we usually buy stuff off of told us that somewhere around here there's a guy that's just been pulling out random games. So hopefully we can get some good deals if he pulls something out that we're interested in. Hopefully we find him before someone else does. Yeah, that's just <laughs> that's what's been happening. I mean, like I said, the guy we buy stuff off of already has like hard gold and soul silver on him. So. Uh, haven't really seen so much for us yet. Matter of fact, none of us have made a purchase yet. I'm definitely getting this. Ten dollars on the skateboard, right? Yeah, I'll do that. Really happy with this one right here. 10 bucks for a penny board, you can't beat that. I have one of these already at home and I use it a lot. So having a spare is always gonna be good. Um, I mean, cause I mean, I paid around 110 when I got mine new uh, a few years back. So $10 for one that I don't have in a different color, I'm happy with that. You know, to be honest, I always see these like clone consoles, but this one I'm really impressed with just because it's portable. Like, yeah, yeah. Nah, and this dope. is all like NES games. Yeah. Like, I'm gonna play Bucky O'Hare. Let's see. And it's playing Bucky O'Hare. This yeah. is really cool. This is really cool. You, you're only here. It's my first time coming out here. Are you gonna come back? Cause I don't know. Oh man, because do you have a card or anything? Uh, take my number. Yeah, definitely. Because. Um, I only brought 10 bucks with me. <laughs> and this might be something that. I'd if you can get 25 together somehow, like ATM or something, I'll do 25. That's literally the lowest I could do. Because, I mean, this thing is. And it, really comes cool. the, it comes with the charger in the box. It's rechargeable. It's chargeable. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. My batteries. Wow. That's oh, awesome. Yeah, dude. It's a phone charger. Headphone <laughs> jack, too? Yeah. This is awesome, man. Get the airplane. Definitely, yeah. <laughs> All right, boys. The rest of the hunting footage is going to be geared towards you because I spent my only $10 on a skateboard. <laughs> and you said you got, oh, careful. You said you got a 10th price, though, so that's Empty. Good. Is Animal Crossing in there? No, it's uh, Cookie Mama. There go your hopes and dreams. I have the game, but I have the Nintendo Switch. Oh, that. is that Conquer? Oh, no, it's not. Pull another Xbox game. Uh, I think there are... Oh, is that Conquer? <laughs> oh, no, it's not. There's no other. There isn't fucking over here. No, Leo, nothing. Is that one Conquer? No, Leo, oh, no, nothing. Not. NASCAR. Is this. 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 Is Mm -hmm. Look, I get it, Sam. Uh, it's the Heroes of the Ruin, which is not a PS1 game, oh. but it's a square game. That's true. I don't think it's square, though, because it's got that little edge at the end. I mean, five dollars. you're essentially paying $5 for a loose Heroes of the Ruin. It's Square um, Enix. Oh, that's dope. That's Skyward Sword, isn't it? That's really dope, bro. Kind of dope. I don't have five bucks, though. Do you want me to cover you? Ask him how much he wants for the controller, too. Contemplation. And then I'm gonna ask him how much for the controller? Yeah. Huh? And that'll get you food or something. Don't really worry about it. You can just pay me back later. I already got enough money for food right now, anyways. Ten each. It's actually really good. Asking ten on that gold controller. <laughs> 
for the gold I'm controller? I'm for it, but we're going to wait on it. Just okay. in case Fruit wants it. No. Oh. That way you can try a bundle or something? Alright, so right now I got my skateboard. Sam's looking at some games and he's looking to bundle with Fruit. Uh, Leo, what are, what are you planning on uh, getting so far? Okay, so so far I haven't seen too much I want yet. I did see those PlayStation Move controls, but there's not really any games I want for it at the moment. It's just kind of a future proofing measure in case I do end up stumbling upon games that I do want for the PlayStation Move, PlayStation 3, PlayStation 4. Actually, if they're if those are compatible with PS3 and PS4, then it might actually be worth getting them because PS Move works with PS, PSVR, if I remember correctly. So if I ever end up getting one of those, then there we go, I'm set. I agree, because I mean like, Granted, if you don't have the itch for it now, if you find it for cheap enough, exactly. and you have the itch for it later, then you covered yourself. Exactly. That's so. why it's like one of those things where I'm not, if I don't get it, oh well, but if I do, then hey, I, I came up on that. All right, good on you. We'll probably walk back there in a bit then. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, you got rejected. So what happened back there, Sam? Man, this guy just told us he would do 15 for a controller and a 3DS game, which was like the Skyward Sword Nintendo Classic controller. And then when we went to go up and offer him price, he's like, no, actually $5 more than what I originally had asked you. <laughs> so he reversed haggled you. Yeah, yeah. it's because it's there were two controllers. There was a Skyward Sword and then there was a regular black one. And I got both of them. I was like, how much for this controller? like, oh, 10 each. And I was like, all right, cool. And then once I went up with the gold controller, he's like, nah, that one's actually 15. And I was like, God. Because I mean, like. That guy's done it before. What, when I saw you guys show him the controllers, he said 10. Yeah. 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 But then once, once I saw that, I wanted the gold one. He's like, oh, that one's actually 15. Man, that guy's done it before, too. So yeah, I just walked away after he said that. I'm like, yeah. no, we're done. Seriously, we're done whatever. Here, guys. Yeah, I guess we'll hopefully find more stuff later. Yeah, let's keep going. Just how much games are? How Children of mine. I don't know what it is. Open it. It's not in there. <laughs> but I'm uh, so genuinely. Can you see those? I'm so genuinely curious what it is. Though. Remember, have you seen Honestly, the, the Transformers? The uh, S games aren't bad. They're really oh, good. Oh, you didn't call dibs on it. Like, yeah. No, nah, actually, that Transformers game is a PS1 Square game. So it's dibs it's on empty, the other side. Every case empty. They're all empty. Yes, empty. Uh, We'll I was excited. Up. We'll probably like <laughs> insert a want wall. I don't know. This has been uh, one of those days where you don't get anything. Wasn't there a so seller funny. with just nothing but. What did he have? Oh, nothing? yeah, yeah. He had the 3DS games and the DS games, but all the boxes are freaking empty. So we saw. <laughs> I saw what was called Children of Mana, and I had no idea what it was. And I was super curious, and then I opened the box and it wasn't even in there. And I didn't even look it up. I think as a retro gamer, if you see the word mana on a video game, assume. yeah, you yeah. automatically gotta assume it's something people give a shit about. Yeah. There's games over there. Have you guys seen? Where are we headed, Leo? I'm gonna look to see if they still have those PlayStation Move controls. Well, if they do, I'm gonna try to get them with the uh, stand charger thing for 10 bucks. Uh, what was your strat with uh, buying this? Because I know you had your eye on them earlier, but we decided to uh, keep on going. No real strat to it, just if I get them, I get them. If I don't, I don't. I'm not too desperate for them, but if I get them, cool. Well, the cool part about that is, you know, Leo still walking around made it, you know, seem that maybe he's interested, maybe he's not. So hopefully he can get a good deal off of it, right? Oh, yeah, good point. I didn't even think about that this time around. <laughs> That's serendipity. It was, just it was just genuine apathy this time around. Uh, but yeah, let's go check him out. Yep. 
so I got my stuff, two PlayStation Move controls, and a charging dock for 10 bucks, which I say is pretty good. What did that work on again, PS3? Yeah, PS3, and if this is compatible with PS4, I just future, I just future-proofed. Not bad. Yep. Just keep going? Good, come up, yeah, let's go down this way. Squad with Thanos. Avatar. There's actually some good PS2 stuff here. There's Devil May Cry 2 right there. And then, this is a fighting game? Yeah, uh, Virtual Fighter 4. K5. Jack 2. Guitar Hero. Hey, look. That. Hats. That middle school hat. This is new. Going to Park Charger. Freeze, sir. You So what did we see, Leo? We saw a Miracle Piano, the piano that connects to the Nintendo, Super Nintendo, and uh, Genesis, I believe. Uh, Leo was asking 35 on it. Honestly, I do not care about it whatsoever, so we just told our friend about it and let him know so he could get it. Did he end up getting it? I'm not sure. I think he's going to walk back around, isn't he? I don't know his tactics, man. Like, yeah, he obviously knows a lot more than we do. Um, if I had the money, and if I was into NES or Super Nintendo, I would have bought it because I think it plugs into Genesis right as well. But I don't have any Genesis. But yeah, that's just something that uh, we collectively said that's really cool. We should get it, and then we're like, ah, damn it, do we really want to spend the 35 on a piano that we don't want? So. It's definitely worth it, and it's definitely, I guess you could say, we caught ourselves slipping. <laughs> but then again, none of us really collect for the NES. And on so. top of that, I don't think any of us really want it. We just saw yeah. it and we're like, oh, it's yeah. something. Um, we'd rather have someone who plays NES stumble upon it themselves. Or sells NES stuff, I guess. Yeah. Because we could have bought it and resold it, but... We don't do that. You don't go like that. <laughs> so I guess we're gonna do another lap or two and then maybe close this out. Um, overall, we did find some some almost deals. I, I'm happy with the skateboard, but a lot of games that would have been a good find were kind of empty in the boxes. So we'll see what happens after we do another lap. We're closing out, boys. Where are we going? I'm gonna go eat. We're gonna eat grab what? some food, and then afterwards we're gonna go keep on going on adventures. Maybe, hopefully, find some more video games at thrift shops. Places and, that or, take card. Yeah, because I don't have cash. I don't I'm, have cash either. I'm a goof. Good will. And we found the miracle piano, and I didn't have money to buy it. <laughs> you didn't want it though. I know, but I'm trying to be dramatic. <laughs> no, yeah. <laughs> That's probably gonna be one of the only times we see one of those things in box, especially since those things are getting more and more scarce. Did you get footage of it? You did, right? No, I was look. I, I legit just I sat did. down, and I, just, I was reading the back of the box. And it said, it said like, Genesis, Tech, Super Nintendo tick, NES tick, and it had like a bunch of other consoles on it. Tic Tac Toe. And I'm like, that's really cool. And it had a bunch of games on it. Then Game Chasers picked one up. All right, just testing this out since I bought it. Speed Racer. Stopped at a nice little taco shop on the road, so getting some burritos in right now before we make our next stop. I'm just trying to get some refueling done on our bodies. All right, so where are we heading now, Leo? We are going to Rasputin, I believe, and uh, hit up a couple other places. I think Isaac mentioned Toys R Us and Goodwill, I believe. Yeah. So 
well, Rasputin's probably not going to have too many games apart from those that they have in that budget section, but we'll see what the other two have in store for us. Let's get it. We're going to Goodwill. Yes. We're going to Goodwill. We just pulled up. Let's see if we can find anything. My arm fell asleep. That too. Oh! There you go. Good thing you came. Boy! Oh my god. $2.89. How, how much is it? G Bill, your mom lets you have two squirtles. Look at this. Come on, Leo, you're in the Baby way. Auto. Boy, this just happened, huh? Yeah. Is the Pikachu down there, too? Thirty dollars. Is that a Pikachu? It's a Minion. Oh, oh that's a Minion. Yeah. Minion. <laughs> in the classic edition. Two eighty nine. Two eighty nine. Two eighty nine. How much is this boy? That's a big boy. There's no price. It's free. Do you have footage of this? Yes. Man. This thing's huge. I need him on the couch in the game room. These, I don't know. What do you, what do you think? The Charmander looks a little derpy. The Charmander looks cute. I like this one because this one looks original. Like, oh, it's 2015. He just has that like angry Gen 1 face. This looks kind of derpy too, but like these two look like they came from the same distributor. Price tag on it, so. You got that Mega Mind head, look. Like. Oh yeah, they do. <laughs> this Bulbasaur is cool though. Uh, this Charmander's dope. Are you gonna get it? Are you gonna get it? No, here you go, you have a Squirtle too. I want this though. This is like, for sure I'm getting this. I just want to know the price. Ooh, look at this stitch. Found myself a friend today. This thing is gigantic. Sam, show me those, uh... Yeah, we found this, Cooking too. Mama. How much are they? They are 99 cents each. Contemplating on getting them. I say you hang on to them for now. That's a good series. I think so, at least. I don't collect for the Wii. 99 cents a game, though. You, just, you can't beat that. You could beat that free. Ninety-eight cents a game. How much? How much did the Squirtle end up costing, Isaac? Like four bucks for the Squirtle. Uh, I was a little bummed because like the rest of the plushies were all like two eighty. But I mean, considering its size, I'm not really upset to pay four bucks for it. And then Sam looked out because he found this really cool Sailor Moon mug that I'm really happy to wash up and just start using for everything in my house. I might use it for like beer, uh, coffee, hell, just drinking water. I'm just gonna use it for everything. I got this Barney VHS too, only because I want to take out the sleeve and I'm probably gonna use this for a custom VHS. Um, just because I think the color pink looks really cool when making like custom tapes and stuff. So, all in all, I'd say Goodwill was a win. So, I'm happy about this stuff right here for sure. Leap. <laughs> it's the wall. Is this something you actually consider? Uh, this is something that, I, that Sam brought me because he mm. pointed out it's 10 bucks at this point. It's made by Funko. Sam's got this uh, fake Funko <laughs> Pop, fake Lego looking Peter Griffin. You know what to do with I like to how him. there's a couple of uh, pieces for his chin. <laughs> the and Bender. Sam and uh, Leo brought up a good point. They want to see if uh, all this stuff up here, especially the Nintendo stuff over in the video game section, uh, would be for sale or given away at, at some any point, point at least yeah mm. no sir i don't like it all right so we just walked out of there we didn't really find anything we wanted um they are like wiped out of all the good stuff they just have a bunch of legos they're... roblox toys Woo. um funko pops Woo. and that's about it there's like one game i want to get but not nah, itching to get it. Us, yeah, we might come back uh, closer to the store's actual final days, but until then, we're not really itching to buy anything at the moment. Um, might buy something like on the last day or a little bit prior. Oh, we forgot to ask about the. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Because uh, they got like some fixtures and displays, and we're thinking about asking them if they'll sell those or or give them away. Hopefully, the latter. So.
If we get those for free, that'd be dope. This is pretty cool. What is this? Mickey Mouse, Seven Dwarves and Friends, Mini. Is it even inside? Is that what it These is? These look like shit. These don't look yeah. like... What'd you say? I said if I caught your CHS, <laughs> it is bad. Yeah, I don't like it. Hey, what? do you guys want the Sims on the PlayStation 2? <laughs> <laughs> this is the majority of what we find. We found something. Original Sim. What your boys find? This is pretty cool. The Temptations. Some sort of music video. Couple, I don't know, it's a movie. No, that makes it less cool, honestly. Yeah. I was all up in it when I thought it was a music video. Hey, there we go. There you go, Isaac. Hey, there you go. Find anything? Hey, no. Not yet. Oh, really? Oh, dude. <gasps> <laughs> Space couple. Sealed. There you go, sealed from Hollywood. <laughs> Isaac glad to me. For the most part, they still have the same games here. Looking at laser discs. Ooh, I didn't know they had laser discs here. Yeah. I feel like every time we come to recipes, we get surprised. Oh, I already have that. What is it? Final Fantasy. Nah, I always look through here. I haven't found anything cool yet, but you never know. Maybe like one day, like the time I do look, it'll be something that like a dollar. Jurassic Park. Sure. Get that for Leo. Leo has a 3DS skin. We'll see if Isaac finds something. This looks like Mike. We just got done game hunting. We played Pokemon Go for a bit. And uh, we might start doing content on that, but thank you guys for watching. We appreciate it. Yeah. Sam, what do you say? I say if they liked it, they should like it. If they didn't like it, don't like it. And if you want to subscribe, subscribe. If you don't want to watch it, don't watch it. But you've already watched it, so joke's on you. Clearly, we've done something right if you watched it all this way through. There you go, boys. God help your miserable souls. All right, peace.